Today, I'm going to show you what I did in the kitchen. These are pickled peppers. These are hot pickled peppers. These are a little bit milder. They had some sweet peppers in them. I made sure of that so that I could eat them. So I'll go and I'll show you what I did. We had a gift from my neighbor who has been in the neighborhood for, I guess, all his life. Since we've lived here almost five years, he has brought me produce. One day I just woke up and there was a fig tree out on the door. And sometimes he brings a bushel load of corn. Whatever he has excess, he shares with his neighbors. So it's not only us, he shares with others too. But he's really sweet. And if I need something, I can always go to Mr. Willie. So don't these look nice? This is what I'm going to show you that I did in our little farmhouse kitchen. So hang on and you'll see from the start to finish when I was cleaning them till I cut them. I did soak them in salt uh, for a couple of hours, try to get some of the liquid out so I could have crisper um, peppers. Hopefully that will work. And I'll show you what I ended up with. Okay. Here we have these beautiful peppers. These are the yellow ones that I think might be hot. And these, there's a few, well, there's a tomato in there too. Um, these big ones are really pretty. They're real long and large, and they do smell like a bell pepper. So I'm hoping those are sweet. I did see some smaller ones in there that look like jalapenos. But other than that, I have no idea what's really in this five gallon bucket but we're going to get started and i will coin these and i probably will take out a few seeds just because especially the hot ones we'll see what we do now here are the ones that i bought at the local grocery store and they are sweet little peppers. They kind of smell like a bell pepper, but they are really tasty and I like them in salad. So I'm going to add them for some color. And as you can see here, when I coined them, it really did okay. brighten them up. So after preparing, washing, dicing, well, I made little coins out of all the peppers. I do not know exactly what the peppers were. Some smelled a little hot. Some smelled like bell peppers. Okay, y'all. This is the end result. I ended up with nine jars of peppers. And the ones that have the red and the oranges in them. I did buy those from the grocery store. And I added them to the bell peppers. So this jar is the jar that I will be eating because it's not quite as hot. It does still have some of those yellow banana peppers and those tended to be the hottest ones. I did wear gloves because once I prepared jalapenos knowing what they were and my fingers burned for two days. Maybe it was good for the arthritis. So anyway, this is what I ended up with, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give us a thumbs up, comment, share, and if you want to see more of what I'm doing in the kitchen, just give us a, um, hit that little notification bell, and we'll let you know. So, see you. Bye.